I think Hillsdale County is magical. I do think back to my freshman year in that summer that I stayed in Hillsdale and every single day a memory that I have is just kind of whimsical. Like it was beautiful every day and everyone's happy and kind. I think that you know people in Hillsdale are hardworking, they're dedicated, uh, and they have a sense that they're working towards something like bigger than themselves, which I definitely think is something that people in the college definitely tap into as well. The college itself is a great community, and the county itself is a great community. They're both centered around interesting ideas. I can always travel to see the ocean, I can travel to see the mountains, but this is where all the important things are. I'm from California originally and born in Santa Maria, grew up in Escondido and then moved to San Diego. I am from Virginia. Um, Virginia Beach is where I grew up. I now live in Hillsdale. When I showed up, I was intending on getting my degree and then moving back to California. As I was here longer though, um, there was a, a feeling that we have here in Hillsdale that we didn't have in San Diego. And it was the, the camaraderie of being here. Everyone wants to know your story. Everyone wants to know how they can help you or relate to you. And I had my first daughter, Chloe. And once I had this little baby that I was responsible for, I thought, I, I want to stay in Hillsdale um, to raise her. I can give her everything here that's important just by staying here. I actually, after I graduated, I didn't really have anywhere to stay. And this couple that I had become friends with from waitressing, they let me stay with them. And you don't find that other places. Everyone's just very hospitable and kind, and it's really genuine. It's really genuine. I met Derek basically right after I graduated college. I was born and raised in Hillsdale, Michigan. My kind of great-grandfather started a shoe store with his two sons. My dad worked in the shoe store. I worked in my father's store growing up. My dad's family has been in the area since the 1840s, I think. Um, my mom's family, 1870s or something. You know who your neighbors are. You know the person who gives you your coffee in the morning. And you gain an experience through that that I think is sometimes a little bit lost in places that are much busier. I opened up my own sandwich shop uh, here um, in 2016 in one dynamic like, oh, I think I know Hillsdale College, and then be put you know, within a five minute walk of campus selling something that everybody loves. And so when I worked at Checker Records, I thought I knew a lot of college kids. And then I came and opened Handmade. We were just reflecting the other day on like, how many like, students that we just like know their order like before they come in. You see community members at basketball games and professors living in town, going to coffee shops. The mission, I feel, is the same. They want what's best for this community. There's a lot of opportunity there to work together and to do things. Obviously, the college's mission is a lot more concrete and tangible, but they, they stand by you know, their motto and their creed. And people in Hillsdale are strangely similar. Um, I'd say that the college and the town are like a lot more alike than they care to admit on either side. <laughs> um, and so like, I think that's cool and probably what makes the two entities work well together. 